All right, uh, let's get rid of you. Let's turn you on. Double check that everything is. Working. Did I turn off the sound or something? Let me just double check. No, no. All working. Okay. Should be good to go. Right. Welcome in. It has been a while since I last streamed. Too much real life stuff getting in the way, but I am on vacation this week, so hopefully we'll get a couple of uh, streams in is the plan. So the idea is to mop up the last few achievements of with Sparta, or I think it's only one. I think I did one at one point very, very early on. I'm reasonably sure. It's starting with mods enabled, we no longer disable achievements. Alright, sounds good. And mixed gender rules. So yes, we'll be playing as Sparta. We will go through, since I'm playing with the Invictus mod, we will go through and get all the um, missions done as well. I think they've done some new missions. Um, but I'm not entirely sure. Sparta, the glory days are long over. Well, we'll see about that. Only a few decades ago, at the Battle of Megalopolis, a Spartan force of 22,000 men was defeated by a 40,000 strong Macedonian army. Spartan King Aegis III, wounded and unable to stand, ordered his men to leave him behind to face the advancing Macedonian army so that he could buy his men time to retreat. Sparta has been left in a weakened position, with the Messenians threatening to the west and Argives to the northeast. We need to restore Sparta to its former glory, put an end to our local rivals, and combat the rise of Macedon to the north. Time to make history indeed. Alexander the Terrible. Is that usually what it says? Uh, Sparta. Oh, it's special for Sparta. Risen except the Spartans. This defiance has never been forgotten by the Macedonians. Alexander the Great humiliated us diplomatically and later militarily at the Battle of Megalopolis. We remain independent, but the guards have mocked us with their twisted sense of humor. The loss of Messene and the Hellots show the Greek world that their own house is not in order, thus our Spartan heritage is slowly losing its credibility, indeed. Most Greeks will remember our absence in the Persian campaign and our failed campaign against the Macedonians. However, as the Diadochia focused on internal wars among themselves, we have a small window of opportunity to reform, adapt and restore the old order. Sons of Heracles, through Hades we will rise. Molum Labe. Indeed. So yes, um, show remaining achievements. We do have Asparta, Conquer and Sack Persepolis. I believe there is one more Spartan one, which I have done at some point. I don't think I continued because it might have been a new patch or something like that. Isn't there one? Egypt, Persia, blah, 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 Jewish Great Destroyer. Ah, uh, yeah. Conquer and Snack Pella before 480. Okay, so it was a short one. All right, let's have a quick look then what we have to deal with. We are the glorious nation of Sparta. We have... Six whole territories. Very powerful indeed. We are Hellenic, so build cost loyalty of governors, national citizen happiness. We do have a unique government, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we have like a co-ruler here. I'm not sure what's going on with this background art. It seems a bit weird. Um, I'm not sure how that works. If I'm... Honest, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Right, free ID slots, yes, let's get that going. Okay, so we are a Spartan diarchy, we have a co ruler, religious ideas, military ideas, so we shall go for morale of armies. Screw navy, so reinforcement speed and army morale recovery, sounds good. And as far as religious goes, 
guess we'll go with civilization level. Uh, we will embrace social equity, I believe. Yeah. <clears throat> We're good. We can call down an omen. Um, we'll probably go to war relatively quickly. So I'm guessing discipline. Let's just check. We do have an additional 5% from Spartan her heritage and 5% discipline as well. National slave happiness. We don't care about that. Imperial Sparta, Deify Spartan Emperor. Are these special? I can't remember the exact modifiers for Empire now. I'm guessing that these ones are just instead of the normal ones, so you keep the sort of diarchy going. Yeah, that must be it. Alright, government. We are on military service. Sounds good. Levy size multiplier plus 10%. Uh, sure. Nothing to worry about here in terms of religion. Legion maintenance cost. Not great, but discipline is okay. National citizen happiness. Okay. Oratory tech investment. Yeah. Integrated culture happiness is pretty good. Well, I would rather have them swapped around, to be perfectly honest. We mainly have our own culture here. We have a few Hebrews roaming around. And let's just check out our missions then. So, Spartan Restoration. <clears throat> we have been ravaged by ambitious foreign warlords, jealous of the might of... Well, I'm not sure there's that not much might in Sparta at the moment. Leaving us weakened. Yeah, okay. And without our allies and subjects of all, if we are to become an important regional actor in Greece again, we need to restore the city of Sparta to its former glory and put an end to our local rivals. When we conquered and consolidated Ore of Laconia. Um, is that an actual province? Yes, it is. Okay, well, that's easy enough. Start the mission. Arius, the Basileus of Sparta, has called for all less... Uh, these guys to prepare for a long and arduous campaign to restore the Sparta of old. We have been ravaged by the Thebans, ignored by the Macedonians, and ridiculed by the Diadochi. It is time to put an end to the limits imposed on Sparta by others and once again rise to the position we deserve the defender of Greece. Okay, so we, 20 year old, get ambitious Spartan, Marshal plus two, finesse plus one. I will take it. Uh, need military experience and we need higher freeman happiness gives us a permanent spearman bonus okay so we want to do that at some point sparta needs five buildings and sparta permanent against spartan infrastructure okay pretty nice uh 20 political influence Ooh, whoops <laughs> on completion gain claim on These ones. How much does it cost to just fabricate? 20 as well. I guess it's quicker. Although we still need some political influence now. Right. Well, with that in mind, let's... Get some extra political influence. Um, we do have inventions. So. We do need to go all the way over down here. So we are probably going to want some wonder building at some point. So it might be worth just going for them straight away. Um, where were we? Innovations. So that would mean, I mean, we do want to go and be able to build great temples, I think. Let's just get this crap sorted. Unintegrated culture group, open religion. There we go, great temples. Religious education we don't need. Um, 
integrated culture happiness and reduce governorship. We'll probably want those later. I don't think we need to worry straight away. So we'd be wanting, um, where is it? Dominance through enlightenment. Definitely. Um, do we want to go for that directly? Let's go for legal patronage. It's always good. Um, we do probably want honored leader. These are a bit terrible, but sure. Let's just muscle away down there ASAP. The Freeman output, pop promotion speed, and... Hyper cost. Alright, that's that sorted. Now in terms of these people here, do we have anyone better? I presume we will. You're intelligent, you are nothing. You're apparently upset. You scorned, really? Really? Let's just get the scholar here. And as far as this is concerned, um, we don't actually have anyone better, so you can stay. And here, I have no idea why you scorned. Two of the following positions. You have two of the following positions. You're clearly insane. Um, but yeah, I think that looks alright as well. Government, um... I mean, I could kick this one out and put you in charge instead. You're still apparently upset. For some bizarre reason. How about we put one of your friends here? We don't have anyone comp- Well, we can put some shitty person here. Don't really care about that. I don't know. The game. I think the game is confused. Unmarried ruler. All right. Get the marriage going then. Um, since we have the co-ruler, I'm not sure if the stats here really matter. I guess we can just take this. Sure. Splendid. Because if we have a look at the government now, it's still this chap, so it doesn't really matter. Agid family. This is Agiad. Do we have an Agid family as well? I don't know. Something seems off. Uh, we have two navies, which is a shame. Let's just do that with them. And we do need some trade routes. So, what would we like? Uh, heavy infantry. Do we have any heavy infantry? We do. It's actually the majority of our troops, so okay. Let's get heavy infantry going straight away. Oh, we already had one produced. Okay, great. And apart from that, precious metals. Precious metal seems fine. Great. Um, I presume we only have the one territory. And I'm just randomly clicking things now. Right, accept all trades, block surplus. Um, I think we'll deny food. Just because. Where is more food? Cheap. Fish. I feel like I'm missing something. Ah, yeah, vegetables. Is there some other food as well now? Grain, fish, livestock, honey counts as food. And dates counts as food. Hello, DJ Coolmaster. How's it going? Um, boom, 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 boom. What did we say? Dates. Honey. Surely this is all of them. Alright. Great stuff. Omen. I guess we'll just go with Discipline. Perfect. 
All right, that sounds good. So we just need a bit more political influence then, and then we can get that mission going. I shouldn't have spent it all, but oh well. You live and you learn. Doing good, just playing Baldur's Gate 3. Yeah, I am probably going to start playing that next weekend with some friends. Um, I've not played the um, open beta or the, whatever you call it. Early access one, so I've not tried it at all. I have played the older Baldur's Gate though, so. How are you finding it so far? What else did we need here? Need more buildings. Do I want to spend some money already? 254 for a great temple. Could be some... Actually, we did have mission here. Average Freeman happiness of 85. Could plonk down a forum. But... Do we want to? 6% extra happiness. It will pretty much cost us all our money. Let's just go and kill these people first and see if we get anything. Never played any of the previous games or any CRPGs? Character RPGs? I'm not sure what the C stands for there. One of the best games I've played. Well, that sounds good though. I'm not sure how much it has in common with um, the older Baldur's Gate one, because it's the same people who made it who made Divinity Original Sin, if I'm not mistaken. I have played Divinity Original Sin 2, which is a glorious game as well, so I wholly recommend that one if you haven't played it. Alright. Messenia have been an essential part of Sparta since time immemorial, until the Thebans under the rule of the warlord... Epi invaded our lands and forced their independence on us. Since the city of Messene was founded, it has stood as an affront to Spartan interest, a pathetic attempt at counterbalance to stop us from rising to power once more. <laughs> Indeed, right, time to crush them. Rival at court. Who is this? Some 75 year old man. Uh. We can lose some popularity, it doesn't really matter. Now the best rated PC game on Metacritic ever. Alright. So we'll see. I mean, not sure if that's just hype or... Oh, we gain a free building here. I mean, I'll get the library done. Do, do Granaries do anything different here? Provincial food capacity, local monthly food modifier. I mean, it's good, but... I'm not sure how the library is <laughs> related to the military, but sure. That's military up. I am not going to say no to a free building. City of Chios. Banned on Chios to carve out a new realm in Paphlagonia. Good of them. Uh, that's in terms of official critic reviews. Okay. How's the user reviews coming along then? I presume they're quite good as well from what I hear. I mean, a lot of people were raving about it while it was in open access or early access as well, so... Uh, I'll just take this... To... We could lose 10 stability, actually. We're trending upwards anyway, so sure, let's just lose the stability. I'll take the political influence, it's fine. What do we get from completing this one? On this one we get some slaves, and owning this gives us... Spartan Guard. Then we need to build buildings there, and then we get the permanent bonus, okay. Okay. Freeman happiness of 63. Oh my god, I've gone depressed now. We'll see. <clears throat> Very great fan reviews as well. Almost beat Hogwarts Legacy's record for concurrent planes on Steam yesterday. Alright. A friend of mine highlighted that they recently put Overwatch 2 on Steam as well. And it has like the most atrocious reviews ever. 
I think it was like 90,000 or something ridiculous in terms of, of uh, negative reviews. Or 90,000 reviews in total, of which 90%. It was something. The, the numbers were ridiculous, at least. I have no idea. You never played Overwatch 2. It's not really my style of game, but... Alright, there we go. Um, you are allied to anyone? You are in a defensive league with a ton of people here. Okay. That is going to make things a bit more interesting for sure. Can we beat them? If we just assault them down, probably. How many troops can we raise here? Seven whole troops. And are there any cheap mercs around? Which we could hire. Five ducats per month. It's worse now. 113k reviews, only 9% are positive. Ah, uh, that is hilarious. Oh my god, stupid defensive. This is like the most massive of defensive leagues ever. But I mean... Um... Surely it can't be that bad. Because if we loot these things down, we'll get money. I think we can afford some mercs here. Sure. Right. Um, mercenaries. 4k, where are you? You're over there. You're over here. Hmm. But it's easy. Take over Crete and integrate, then you come on to 30k army. Yeah, but that feels like the slow and boring path. I'm sure we can do this without working on Crete first. That seems like a cheating way of doing it. Let's just get these guys. It'll be fine. You, my friend. Let's wait a day. Come on. Stopping all your platforms. Get your ass over here. And then what we'll do is simply declare war on you. There's a lot of troops coming in here. You'll be fine. Let's just go for it. And we will raise the levies here. Get you marching straight away and see whether we can take these guys out. Nice. Troops are running away. Quick assault. And we will loot all the stuff over here. So there are 13 people here. Just kill them all. And then I will take your stuff. Okay. Imprison their leaders and imprison people. Sure, probably hired some um, more expensive marks instead. This will be fine. Okay. One down. Um, should we just hire another mercenary army? We can only support one mercenary. I should have hired a bigger stack. Alright. That's okay. Nothing to worry about. Um, are you still going to suicide into me? Let's just have a quick look here. So, diplomacy. We are fighting you as well. Should we just go and take care of you quickly? See whether we can get the reorganization take care quickly. Oh, there's a lot of troops coming in. That's alright. 
Snack wiping those ones. Okay, it's bite me a few too many. Please win quickly. Oh my god. Okay, nice. It's all good. This is all sorted. And um, where were we? Right. Diplomacy map mode. Who to take out next? You are being way too slow in getting anywhere. I don't think it really matters who we take out. Let's just go for you. Don't do that. Can we? We can probably assault this down quickly. Yes. Okay. Um, none shall hide. Yeah, screw it. Let's just kill the crap out of you. Imprison your leaders. Very nice. And let's just... Ooh, he's actually doing stuff to my thing over there. Not ideal, but I'm sure we can cope. Uh, we just need to recover a bit over here, and then we should be fine. And yeah, let's just get rid of some more of these ones. Okay, we're fine with the economy now. I should have hired a bigger freaking army. Alright, let's see if you can recover some morale here before. Or well, it would be even better if you went and smashed into these troops. Get you another recovery tick, and then we can send you off to Siege Town. Argus would be good to get out of here of the war ASAP, so yeah. Maybe we'll just go there. No longer importing precious metals. And it's a bit annoying. Local citizen. Actually, we should go with something that gives local freeman happiness. Just go with leather. That'll work. And you are finally making your way over here. Okay. Antigonids are having fun there. And you will lose all of your morale now? No, you will not. Yes, you will. <laughs> That's alright. He can't get that one down just yet. This one is fully re um, replenished now, so... We don't want to attack them. Um, but we'll just go and slam into these troops, though. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. Is our navy strong enough to blockade here? I presume they have a port. If we lose it, it's not the end of the world, so that's fine. We are apparently just. I'm not entirely sure how that happened, but... Let's get you moving here. Oh, he's actually abandoning the siege. Even better. Can we catch some of you out in the open? Supply shortage. Um, I think we can probably beat this. Wait one more month. He's trying to run away. We're catching anything? Yes, we're catching something. This should be crushing them. Thank you. And after that, we can swing you up here and just crush these guys. Okay, I mean, you, you have fun over there. We're busy down here. would like to get Siege going on something else. Let's just go and grab you then. Or should we crush this army? Sure. Alright. We have a disloyal character here. 
random researcher. All right. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. Zero percent here. Can we get you sorted? No. Antigone is now at war with Thrace. Wow. This is turning out to be quite brutal up there. Okay. 28% chance. Oh, no. Evil battle. <laughs> All right. We lost one ship. Oh, okay. Well, we didn't lose our entire navy, at least. So, there is that. Back to 21%. There we go. All right. Siege of Argos is one. Uh, 13 people there. I think we're just going to grab all the money. And then... Uh, this one should flip automatically. How many provinces do you have? Three. Antigonids is occupying this. You at war with the Antigonids as well? Well, that's not boding very well for you. Um, let's get you moving on to that thing there, Dan. We'll just start sieging down someone else instead. As far as you're concerned. Cannot take that one. But I'm tempted to just piece you out regardless. I think he will let surrender. Yes. And you should be out of this war now. All right. few more to go. I'm not sure whether this is the sensible thing to do, though. Still, we do have way too many forts, but we'll sort that out after. Ha ha ha! The seas outbreak, you can't even siege it. You hideous, hideous fool. Okay, there's a lot of troop marching on to us now, which is not ideal. Should we just go and crush this army instead? That seems better. And then we can hide behind the forts and go there. Recuperate losses. Who is this? Hierophant. Losing loyalty against corruption. Let's just kick him out. And... We'll put someone else in charge there. Sure. There we go. Sorted. Water shortage. Yeah, so they should be sort of stuck on the forts here now. Oh, good. Gout. Finish this siege. Um, another one. Okay, good. We did win that siege at least. We need another tax person. Tend to just put him back in charge, to be honest. I'll put her in charge. There, yeah, that'll do. Alright, great stuff. Um, can we go and beat this army or should we just ignore it? Can we not? Are we not at war with you? No, apparently we're not at war with this one. Alright. Interesting. Well, let's march you around this way then. So now we could technically peace out if needs be. Oh good, they're suffering attrition there as well. I think we'll just go and slam into them, to be honest. Or not, just they're running away. Put you on there then. And let's just see whether we can out-siege them here. We have a breach. We do not have a breach. He is going to suicide his troops onto my mercenaries, which seems fine. I'll take that fight. Good job. And we should be able to out-siege him and then scare him off once we finish this. Hopefully. I mean, you never know. For some reason, it always feels like the AI is getting super lucky when it comes to these kind of sieges. 
All right. Minus seven, yeah, he's catching up. Supply shortage. Can I get military access to you? Don't don't want you to move there. Yes, I can. That way we can at least deal with that one relatively quickly. Oh, come on. Please. I mean, I can split off an army and try and scare him off, but... Fields. Okay, nice. Great. Um, eight people there. Just kill them all. Grab all the money. Ease you out. Imprison leaders. Um, it's just limited to adults as well, just in case. Get more money. Right. There we go. And we should hopefully get there before he has a chance. Yes, he's running away. Very good. As long as he abandoned the siege, it's all good. So I guess we can go and deal with those ones then. Breakthrough. Very nice. I think we'll go for citizenship and then dominance to enlightenment. We could also then go for petition of minorities, which is pretty good to be perfectly honest. All right, he's back there. That's okay. Nothing to worry about. Stack wipe those troops. Siege this down and live long and prosper. And we got 400 whole ducats. Which means we could look at building another building here. Let's just get the great temple sorted now. While we have some cash. White peace imminent. So if, ooh, no, 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 no. Alright. That is not what we want to see. We'll have to go and fight them then. Okay, great. Get you out of this war as well. Um, and there's one person living here, so... Uh, imprison leaders again. Right, who else is left in this war now? Still at war with you. Alright. Onwards and upwards. What tactics are we employing here? Bottleneck, yeah, that seems fine. Stack wipe those ones, and... Once this is sieged down, all will be well. Thank you. Phew! It's getting a bit worried there. Alright, so apart from that, we're still at war with you. Can we get to you? Yes, we can. Alright. Uh, forced to intervene in trade disputes. Who are these people? They're not very loyal. Home county in ruins. Oh, well, I mean. Who's better? Emperor, whatever. Oh good, we're starving to death here. These are mercs anyway, so that's fine. They can starve a bit. No one's too worried about that. So we can go all the way up here and actually conquer this guy's land as well. If we can get military access through you, I guess. Well, we need military access through you as well to be able to get to that one. But I guess that's okay. I mean, at the moment the Diadochia are too, you know, busy to do anything anyway, so we don't need to worry too much about them. Um, how are we doing in terms of forts here? Well, we have all the forts in the world, so we probably don't need quite so many. Is this mine? 
No, not yet. Now let's get rid of some of these forts here. Status quo is not what we're looking for. Oh my god, we're starving relatively quickly here. 7%, yeah. You better roll a bit better here. Status quo is not what you want. Trust me. We'll be starving to death before long. Supply shortage. I mean, at least that does give us some progress, so. Water shortage, that's better. Come on. You don't want to starve. Uh, lack of food. Oh, none of them have food now. Excellent. That's exactly what we wanted to see. Uh, who are you? Random person and a researcher. Let's send a random person. Uh, I don't want to do this. Should we just ignore this guy? think we will. He looks like he's about to be occupied by um, Epirus anyway. Oh good, we haven't even got enough to water shortage. Come on. Do we have a breach? We do not have a breach. I mean, I can move them off, but we'll lose siege progress, which I'm not super keen on. We don't particularly care about the mercs, of course. We'll be hiring some better mercs. Risk of rebellion. Uh, it'll be fine. It's in this province here. In good hands. Alright. No! Oh my god, she's going to spend all of our money. Uh, sure. We can be friends. All right, nice. Gain some stability. I will take it. Spend 200 gold to unlock a deity. Um, I don't think we want to do that right now. That seems like a unsensible thing to do. Lose five ducats for a bunch of bonuses. That seems fine. Should I just peace out? This is very, very painful. Come on. 21%, I believe in you. Yes, okay. Alright, let the looting be gentle now. Uh, peace you out. And we will... Imprison the leaders. You need to get some freaking food back. So, let's sell all of these people. After 300 ducats again. These mercs are starving to death, but that's alright. We don't need them afterwards anyway. And yes. They're dying up there. Very nice. Right. One food. Oh my god. It's resupplying so incredibly painfully slow. Still, we might not need that much. You're not doing very well, though. <laughs> uh, three food out of a maximum of 18. Four food. Wait one more month and then we'll send them in. And hopefully they'll be fine until they can finish sieging that down. Shouldn't be too long. He did make some progress. Six food. Right, let's get you in there. Once you're in here, we're just going to dismiss these guys. Uh, come on. Chop, chop. 
and yeah, you, my friend, I'll take the loss of those men. Fort defense, no breach. We got 14% though, so. Should it fall, the path east and south would be free. The tribes would invade Greece, yada yada yada. We don't particularly care about Pella being sieged. I think you're mistaken, game. 28%. Thank you. And the piece you out as well. And imprison your leaders. So the question here then, who else is left in this war? It's just Aetolia. Aetolia is... At war with who now? You. Okay, well I mean that's... Could just go and siege them down. Will you give me military access? You will. Fine. Uh, Delphi besieged. Don't care. How are we doing in terms of food, by the way? Well, we are going to need a bit more food before we start. I, I don't care. Okay. None of these places matter. I appreciate what you're trying to tell me, but the girls in Anatolia. All right. Good for them. Zero food. It's going to take too long. I can't be out waiting for it. We'll take all of their land later. Just do this for now. And yeah. Allow us to complete missions. Imprison their leaders as well. And we can stand our troops down. Spend all levies. Date will be increased by up to 24 months. Da, 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 da. Alright. Great. We can have another import route. Um, can we get precious? No, we cannot. We could get more leather though, which will actually give us spearmen. No, we cannot get that. Um, should we just get more food? Wine? Wine will give Freeman happiness as well? Sure, just get some wine there. Alright, not too bad still. Um, we can get some slaves, I will take it. Messenia has finally returned to the fold and become part of Laconia proper once more. The arrogant helots have been put in their place and we can celebrate with the knowledge that the gods sung of our victory from the very start, proving our cause was a just one. Indeed. We can do this as well for 10 military experience. I definitely think that's worth it before we... The Skidatai were once a people loyal to the Spartan cause, living in the barren hills and mountains in the northern Laconia and southern Arcadia, but after our defeat at Theban hands, they have chosen to stay out of our conflicts. Though rural and more akin to Arcadian neighbors, the Skidatai were valiant warriors and an important pillar of our army. Having them return to us would prove a valuable boon. Sounds great. Okay, we need that one now. We can just fabricate on it. Um, you need more buildings there as well. Again, I believe we have a few too many forts here. Although it is quite tasty to have them in the mountains here, but... Let's just get rid of them for now. It'll be fine. We do have a bit of war exhaustion, but we can just go and get some devotion going there. Ah, Lepron. Perfect. There we go. So we now have a now oh, we have military access. Cancel military access. Need to wait until the levies are available again though. 
Uh, April next year. All right. Well, I guess we're going to be a bit peaceful for now then. Scorned family again. Eripontids. You know what, Eripontids? I have a feeling you love navy. I do not, though. Oh, I just remembered. I forgot to actually increase morale of armies by fighting there in terms of um, army maintenance. Oh, well. It all worked out in the end anyway. Offer alliance from Polhyrinia. Who the heck are you? Down there. Actually, you know what? I'll take this alliance. Um, just because it'll make it easy to land and take over all of that. So, yeah. I think that works out quite nicely. Do you have a bunch of political influence? Do we need to spend political influence on anything here? Um... Okay, Spartan Guard, eh? Farming settlement building. Well, we do need to build a farm then, at least. Um, presumably here. We have a port. Don't be ridiculous port when we can have a farm. Foolish, foolish game. Port where we can have a mine? Oh my god. Save a bit of money in case we need to hire some more mercs. You can never be too, too safe. Are you building another stupid fort? Uh, employ Eolas. An ancient... Ten political... Oh, Alright, fine. Right, this is finishing on June 56. When could we raise our armies? April 56. I'm actually speed up a bit here. Breaking alliance. All right, I mean, you do you. you, you, you. <laughs> that's all I'm saying. Don't think that's going to work out very well for you, but whatever makes you happy. 254 for a great temple. Too expensive at the moment. For sure. Uh, as far as Omen goes, I think we'll keep going with discipline. Just to make sure we can... We have been insulted. Okay, I mean... Antigonid has been carved up. Yep. Yeah, that looks pretty much as expected. How are we doing in terms of people now? We do have 10 troops, which is nice. Um, we do have some other filthy cultures here, which we obviously do not want. Skirtai Youth. Uh, get some freemen. I will take it. Gain money. Argos. Gains a marketplace. Ask the residents what they want. Residents want library. Good choice. Okay, that one's done. Uh, this one needs five or more buildings as well. Kind of wanted to get rid of the fort, but I guess we're keeping it for now. All right, well we're too poor to do that. Turn slaves and farming settlement. We can move some slaves over afterwards. It's not the greatest though, it's just a temporary bonus. But I guess we're going to need it for these things anyway. I need two of the following. Province of Laconia has freed Hella State Info. Oh my god, we need to spend on that as well. Okay. Fair enough. With the city status and the port, navies... Oh my god, we need a navy? Wow. <laughs> That's a ridiculous concept. Alright, we're coming up to April. So, once we are there, we should be able to just declare war on these ones and get this one before they can build another stupid fort. Harvest failure. Yeah, we can spend 10 ducats, that's okay. 
Okay, army is available. 424. So, on the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rise of Pergamon. Okay. Game, okay, thank you. Let's just slow down. There we go. You, my friend, I am going to. Your ally, too. Oh, nice! Nice! You have a wonder over there as well. Perfect. Yeah. Um, so we'll just raise you here. Get you charging straight in. Should we pay extra? I mean, probably makes sense. We'll just slaughter this army. The heck is this? Sparta against a claim. Sounds fine to me. I mean, we are going to just grab it now anyway, so. Uh, Celtic Phrygia. Alright. Nice. Um, I think we just assault this down, right? The looting be gentle. We can be nice now, and... Oh, do you have a beef? Oh, you do have a... Oh, do I still have prisoners? I do. Quite a lot of them, actually. Alright. Need to check what this wonder does as well. See if it's anything good. I'm going to assume no, but... We have so many delicious prisoners. Okay, maybe we can spend some money on some buildings here then. Let's get a library going. Actually... Academy. Let's get Academy going. Stack wipe that army. Stack wipe another army. Ah, oh, thousand people suffer through horrible, horrible siege times. Do you have a port? You have two ports. You have a navy. You have no navy. Alright. Show us our naval might. Where the heck is your port? Oh, nice breach. Could actually assault it then, but... Are we blockading it? Looks like it. Ah. This is very, very tempting. Sure. What could go wrong? Looting be gentle, and give me all of the stuff, please. Okay, nice. And disband all the levies again. And let's not pay that much. Alright, good stuff. So, we're not going to have a double fort. That's just ridiculously, and we're not going to have that fort done either. Alright, so what do you do? National citizen output, local citizen happiness. Alright. Not the most impressive, but not the worst either. So, we now have this one here. It is for the best. Machine still needs one more building. Um, we need a few more troops to actually make space for it. Could dedicate a holy site, but it seems like a bit of a waste. Right, do we have claims on anyone else around us? It doesn't look like it. 
So, is it time? So, who are you? You're allied to this guy. And this guy is allied to Macedon. Right, let's just fabricate on you then, for now. That should be good. Mission-wise, um, spend a bunch of money. Ten slaves and farming. Okay, we need to wait for a farm to get built at least. And then we can just shift some farms over there and get that one completed. Just for the sake of it. We are also going to need more ships. Which is... Ugh, not something to look forward to. But okay, we can live with that. Conquest of our people. Yeah, well, I mean, it's just the way it goes. Fort maintenance, yeah, we're paying. Oh my god, look at this. This is ridiculous. Why are we paying? We're definitely getting rid of this fort at least. And we should speed things up. Uh, yeah, I know we can complete that one. How are we doing with these buildings, though? We also need some people. I mean, we can shift some slaves over here as well. We want to pay for it. Um, but I guess we're not in a super hurry just yet. I'm very tempted to demote some of these um, other cultures to slaves, though. Just to get them... I mean, look at them. They're going to be unhappy regardless, so... Don't see any reason here. Going into slave. There we go. Minus 13 as a base one. Yeah, you as well. Slave away. Okay. Polyrinia is going to... Cl okay, good... Yeah, that's that's true. We should go down here. You have no allies or anything, so why don't we fabricate a claim on you as well? That'll give us access to the island itself. Right. Um, farm has not yet finished, but it's almost done. There we go. Currently have seven slaves here, so if we just move some slaves here from wherever. That means we can finish this one. Great. Oops. Um, what else have we got there then? Expanding the infrastructure. We need to... Spend points on... <laughs> How much do these things, stupid things, cost now? We're not going to get any free ones from technology anytime soon, are we? No. Should go for theological colleges, though. Hmm. Ah, alright, fine. Let's do the buildings, because then we might be able to complete that one, so... There's not a building one anymore? Huh. Swear this used to... Isn't this building normally? Is it because we are... Sparta or did they change it in the... Um, mod? Alright, well, let's go with 
Why is this one more expensive? Or rather, why, why is this one cheaper? Go with population capacity for now. I guess paying all debts. Sparta gains, okay. I'll take it. Free money is free money. Provincial investments. Do we already have an investment? No, we do not. Yeah, technology is maxed at the moment. We do have more cities here. It's okay. Um, we could shift people over here to get another building done. Problem is, they might just move away. We'll see. We still need a few more missions. We still need this one anyway. So... Army size of at least 10. Navy size of at least 15. Yeah, yeah. Okay, great. So that's that one done. Now, Hermione. Hermione? <laughs> uh, are you at war currently? Oh, you have a, harmo a revolt here, eh? Which is fighting your ally. It's a bit annoying. To be perfectly honest. Minister of Excellence. Uh, yeah. They would still come in. So we can still possibly march through here. I'm not sure. Can we raise our army by the way? We can. Let's declare war and see what happens. Um, get these troops here. Now we need to go on top of this one. We're definitely going to hold the Olympics. Foreign claims on Arcadia. I didn't read who has claims, but... Epirus wants an alliance. Where the heck are you even? Seriously, where are you? Oh, there. It's like two of you. Um, no. I might take an alliance with you. Did you want an alliance? No. Thrace? Thrace will take an alliance. Ah. What, you? Will you take an alliance? No. Could try and smooch up to... The old Egyptians down there. Alliance with Thrace. Are they going to run into anyone? I might go to war with Macedon, but yeah, right. Let's ally them for now. Uh, were you at war, by the way? No, you're not. And I'm sure it's fine. Okay, they seem to have... Kidonia. Back are you. There's another one on the island here. Yeah, I'll take this alliance. Because then we can land there and kill everyone else, essentially. Which seems like the sensible thing to do. Okay, they seem to have sorted out all of them into our... Sure. I'm not sure if they're actually going to help out, but... Let the looting be gentle, and um, I guess we're just going to go and crush this army. They won't stand a chance anyway. Especially if they don't even stay. Come on. Uh, I should slow down a bit while we're at war just in case. Okay, this... Okay, there were no troops there. <laughs> Good. As I planned. Uh, split this in half. And take the other half over there. We'll siege it back straight away. 150, so it should only take a couple of months. Uh, the holy site in Capua. Don't really care. As long as you're not threatening mine, 
then it's all good. See if my ally actually manages to get over here and help out. No idea what these guys are doing though. Oh, you're going to suicide yourself. Excellent. Good job. I, I am impressed by your bravery. Feel free to fling in some more troops here if you want to. I'm more than happy to welcome them as well. Should we just do this? Unlocks the deity. Can't see what they are like. Well. I have a lot of building slots here actually. another farm down for now okay great we have a claim on you now hello fungus eye how's it going so we'll siege down these guys and then we should be able to look at because we can get military access through you right yes 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 we can just land troops there, and we should be able to just go to war straight away. It will be glorious. Nothing to worry about. And at least, unlike in CK3, we can just have our armies raised before we go to war. Found you because our names are similar. <laughs> true, true enough. All right, uh, we should just be able to piece you out. Thank you. And we'll imprison your leaders as well. And then, oh my god, there's another stupid fort here. I did not notice that. Okay, we'll go for that one. Nice to meet you as well. I don't stream very often, but I am on vacation this week. So, should be able to squeeze another stream or two in for sure. Sacking. There we go. So, let's just go and smash his army to bits, because why not? That way we don't need to worry too much about it. I am originally from Sweden, but I live in the UK. There we go. 7%, and we are catching this army as well. Um, What the heck is this? Oh, I joined some random rubbish war of uh, race. I see. Uh, well, I'm sure they can handle it on their own. How about yourself? Where are you from? And that army has been stack wiped. So with that, am I actually paying my troops extra now? No, we're not. Okay, good. So we just need to wait for that siege. And then we look at... Crushing Polyrenia down here instead. I actually get some claims on some other people as well, like... You have no allies. Oh, we have a truce with you. Alright, let's get the claim going on. Actually, we do need political influence to get these stupid things going here, right? Don't we? Uh, where is it? Yeah, state infrastructure... We don't have state infrastructure. That doesn't exist anymore. Huh. Direct investments are heroic freeze. These don't exist. We Either I've done some changes and not updated this, so I guess we have to go for the heroic freeze then, which is not great, but... I guess that's our only option. Alright. How about this? You are allied to Macedon. Macedon is being wrecked at the moment. 
is kind of hilarious. So you're allied to Macedon. Um, how about these guys here? You're not allied to anyone. I mean, anyone important. So we can definitely just do some cheeky little aggression there, I think. A discreditable dal dalliance. So someone done make this go away. Keep it secret. Yeah, let's just make it go away. We don't care. And usually what happens is that the son is going to return in like 20 years and go, Oh my god, I am the true heir to the throne. Give me all of your things. Alright. There we go. Cannot disband Levis while at war. Yeah, but I'm... Uh, I'm not really at war, though, game. It's an illusion. Right. Um, and that's, if that's the case, let's just sell some people into slavery to make ourselves feel better. Oh my god, we have so many of them. Dum de dum. I really wish there was a sell all button. Well, we do have a decent amount of money now. We just get enough people. I mean, we can transfer some people over to... Um, oh my god, there's even more of them. To the territory that we need five buildings in and then just complete that part of the mission. No! Ah, <laughs> oh, I did not want to seek treatment. Well, we just lost all our money. Well, not all of our money, but... How expensive is it to seek treatment here? 200 ducats. Well, that's great. Not the first and not the last time that's going to happen. All right. There we go. A bunch of new happy slaves. Um... All right. Let's get this crap going then. We have a new deity, Artemis Orthia. Are they any good? So if we were to replace you, it's not one of those. Not one of those. No, so, alright. So we need to check once this finishes uh, and see what the new one does. And then we'll go from there. We could replace a deity. We do have enough stability and we're not going to lose stability anytime soon. Like this one, I would like to replace with something that's, you know, useful. Monthly political influence is decent. National Noble Happiness is decent. Monthly Ruler Popularity is... Couldn't care less. Stability change, you say? That is probably going to be very useful later. So maybe we'll just bite it and put that one now. Yeah. Go for it. Uh, stability is always great. Right, so you are faffing about up there. I mean, surely you're going to win this anyway. Military access from some random people's revolt. I mean, sure. You want to. And then we need to save up political influence to actually get, well, heroic free years then going, I guess. Because we're not getting any more free claims here. Can we get... When's the next time we can summon the War Council? 65, so that's five years left there as well. That is... Oh, 
I will take it. Fort maintenance is through the roof again. Oh my god, I have 10,000 food. Chill game. What is this madness? Yeah, we're not having all of these forts here. That's not happening. Okay. Military access from the Antigonids. Alright. You know what? Just have military access. I do not care. Enjoy life. It's going to be great. Now, income should be a lot better. Now we're not paying ridiculous amounts for fort maintenance. Yes, we're actually making money. Do we want to just shift some people over here? So what we can do is just take some people from Sparta. Gives us an additional building slot. Should we just get the temple? Let's just... Let's spend them. We'll get the temple going. Everyone's going to be so grateful over there. Sure, you can all have military access. It's just one big happy family. Now, if you want to give me some claims so that I can attack some people as well, that would be even better. Right, our Archie sum up. Relax. This guy is not very happy. Because he's been ignored. The good news is I can just replace you, say, with this random old person. And they'll like me a lot more. So there we go. Okay, that's all pretty good. You are fighting. Enjoy. Now the thing is, we do also need a navy. Unfortunately. Further down here. We're going to need 15 ships. Which is disgusting. Um, isn't there a build to build to navy? Okay, start like that. If I keep pressing, it's probably going to just stack more ships into Messine because the AI is insane when it comes to this sort of rubbish. So we'll just get those going. Um, let's just speed up because we don't really care. This is not a real war. What risk you just use for peace? Okay, great. White peace. I'll take white peace. Let's just disband all the levies. Very well. And now we should be able to... Oh, right. I can't raise you now. Who is this other person on? Right, so we have you. Which will pull in this guy as well. Very nice. And we also have the ability to start going for the island here. I think we might just... Oh, man. Right, so we can replace you with... Where is the new one? Is it just this one? No. Oh, here they are. Pop capacity, global monthly mo food modifier. Terrible, not terrible. Could potentially look at changing you. Would be nice to have a passive bonus. Or unintegrated culture, happiness, or discipline. Ah, oh, that's good. We'll just go with you anyway. And where were we? Alright, some random old person has died. Very nice. And we can raise our armies. No, not yet. We can raise our armies next month.
You're at war with someone? You're at war with Pelin here. Alright. It's not really going to help you. Um, should I wait for... Well, they might actually take that over. You know what? Let's just do this. Split you in half. If I can find a button to split you in half there. Get military access from our good friend over here. Wait for these ships to merge up. Get your ass over here. And just slow down so we don't lose too much time. Get you down here. Oh, I can just do this even. Even better. Alright. Get you lot here. Group you up. Declare war on you. Don't need to call any allies. You can smash the snot out of your troops. Might actually pull you out there. No, we're not going to do that. Okay, building sorted. And they permanently get... Uh, bonus so that is great right so forge in both of those ones to get some freemen i don't think that's worth it no we need a bit more political influence to get this going though after that well we are going to need some more stupid ships but apart from that we are done Uh, do you not have an army? Should I just assault it? You know what? Okay. Imprison leaders. Very nice. And let's just disband all the levies. Right, so with that, let's get you back there. Let's sell all of these people into slavery, hopefully without accidentally seeking treatment for any of them. that taken care of um, ships are on the way over here speed up a bit we will build to this navy six there will be one more so let's just do it now no okay it didn't do it in a completely idiotic way all right uh, <clears throat> this is coming in in next month Thank you. Can we raise our armies? No. December? What did they beat up? They waited for them to actually um, recover from the manpower, I guess. Oh well. <clears throat> we can get this one going relatively soon at least. Which is fine. I guess we can speed up for now. More trade routes. Can we get leather? No, we cannot. There's very few things we can get. <laughs> Stone is a good one. We should try and grab some of that. And also, we can delete the fort from here now. Because we already completed that mission. So that's all good. So we do this one, and then we get free province investments. I guess that's okay. Um, so we need state infrastructure directed investments, none of which we can get, or heroic frieze. Unless this one... Oh, it gains directed investments. Okay. 
local import route or supply limit as it's in output. I think we'll go for an additional import route. That seems like a more sensible thing to do. And it's also a bit cheaper on political influence, so that seems fine. Right, with that, we just need to wait for our armies to be available. Galatia. The heck is Galatia? Uh, yeah, I will join you in your war. Hmm. Technically. You're still at war with Pelin here, which is interesting. Right, military. Okay, we'll just wait until January instead because it's close enough. Right. So, we will go here. Get our army here. Go straight on to that one. Don't think we need to call anyone into our war. It'll all be fine. And now we... Oh yeah, we need to wait for that one anyway. But after that, we'll be able to complete both of those missions and move on from there. Um, do you have a port? You do not have a port. You are fully garrisoned though, which is a bit annoying, but... I mean, actually, what we can do here probably is... Um, is there not a split in half? Yeah, there is. And get you going over there. Good job, Thrace. I'm proud of you. What the heck happened to Macedon? I was not paying attention <laughs> at all. All right. Well, uh, good on you. Okay, two free province investments. We have Spartan ports. We have this random person. Very nice. Spartan man gives us manpower recovery speed. It's only temporarily though. And gain popularity. Sure. Finish the mission gives us second rise of Spartan manpower recovery speed. Monthly ruler popularity gain. Monthly military experience. There is nothing else here, so I guess we'll go with this one. Okay. Despite the troubles of the last century, with the appearance of dangerous foreign threats like Thebes and Macedon, the loss of many of our local subjects and the independence of Messenia, we have once again risen to prominence. Good stuff. With Laconia thoroughly in our control and our old friends and subjects once again loyal, we start looking outwards from our local region and towards distant lands. Be it Athens, Thebes, the Diadochi or any other threat, they will not be able to stand in our way as we look to the future. Indeed. It has long been a goal of ours to form a hegemony in the Peloponnesus, a league to protect against ambitious foreigners. With all of the peninsula under our rule, we would no longer have to fear the other Greek city-states and leagues, nor the Diadochi. Okay, don't know exactly what that is. I don't know. Well, let's go with this one anyway. Olympia has city status. Okay. It needs a great temple. Okay. Rural Arcadia needs buildings everywhere. Rebuilding Argos. Okay. Northern coastlines. Okay, a bunch of people. By the megalopolis, yada yada yada, okay.
All right. Well, we we'll go for that one at least. Homo Zeus. So this needs to be a city. Uh, well, we don't have the political influence for that, so that will have to wait. Um, need more trade routes. We can we can't even get stone. What is this? Dates? I mean, we are so shit at trading. Fine, let's get some dates. Speaking of trading, we do actually own some other provinces now, so we should get... What's the name of our capital province? Laconia. So these, go ahead and trade. It'll all be good. And you're busy sieging down someone else, which is fine. You do that. Are you? Yeah, right, we'll take you there. Alcoholic, hi. Nice to catch me on Twitch. Yeah, yeah, I haven't really had time to stream much lately, so, but I am on vacation this week and the next, so hopefully we'll be able to do some streaming then. I'm waiting for the next IR run on Twitch. Yes. <laughs> Uh, we're definitely holding the Olympics or Twitch. Yeah, I think it's going to be, uh, I mean, this one will go up on YouTube, of course, but it will take a while, though. Um, but I think the current CK3 campaign is going to be a bit longer, unfortunately. <laughs> right. We will not. Da, 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 local population happiness seems fine. Free stability, always great. And we shall see. Other things otherwise? Are you playing any Imperator Rome yourself these days? Right. What else did we need here? Home of Zeus. Yes. So we do need a bunch of political influence. We are. Influencing, yes. I haven't seen any real events regarding it, unfortunately. I do not care. This is of no consequence to us, one way or the other. Alright. Come on, people. I need to get some sieges done. Uh, how are you going to suicide into me? Go for it. I'm more than happy to receive you. Oh, holy... Schmoly, are we actually going to lose here? It certainly looks like it. Right, never mind. Let's go back. Maybe I should increase the payment to my troops. Thracian, Odrysia, or Thrace. Oh, okay, fine. Splendid event. Surely, yeah, that's more like it. Okay. Good job. Um, with that, let's get you lot back to sieging that one. And all will be well. Finish this siege, please. Thank you. I would like to peace out this guy. I will more than happily be a regional power. And we shall imprison all of the leaders. And I guess you can follow along down there. And where were we? Ah, uh, yes. More prisoners. Good job. Let's get rid of these guys. All that is sorted. And what have we got? Yes, so we do have... Could fabricate a claim. Do I need political influence? Yes, I need to create cities. Ah, uh, need more political influence. Can we summon the War Council yet? If I can actually find it. Ah, uh, yeah, that was 65. So that's three more years for that one as well. Ugh. Um, also, we do seem to have a fort too many here. So off you go. Meanwhile, do we have any other cultures we can piss off by... Casting them out. You're already a slave. Slaves. Argolian. 
Well, if you're going to be whiny, then there you go. Get slaved. Arcadians. Well, they're not angry with us at the moment, but... Should really get rid of them. Alright. Good news. Um, we are technically losing this war, but not for much longer. And what did we need here? So rural Arcadia here. Territory of Megalopolis, but we also have Megalopolis is going to get a bonus somewhere. Yeah, local tax, pop-up sim assimilation speed. Is that because it is the capital? Yes, and it is actually a city. Okay. Fair enough. But we do need to build buildings up there. And everywhere else. City status. Oh, God. Need more political influence. We are regional power, though, so that is a bit better. Okay. Argos needed buildings as well, or how was it? Yes, three or more buildings. Give you a great temple as well? I mean, why not? Might as well spend all the money we can. Uh, let the looting be gentle and peace you out for all your stuff. Okay, wait for this one to fall and then peace you out for all your stuff. There we go. And imprison your leaders as well. But the problem is we can't get rid of our troops now because we're technically at war. Which is, you know, not ideal. Um, the northern coastline, we still need this one as well. And again, it's political influence because I presume we do not have... <coughs> yeah, we do not have a CB on them. So what to go for first... Probably that's going to cost us political influence as well. As long as you remain a feudatory against stewards of Olympia, which is state religion happiness plus 5%, which is pretty tasty. Huh. Are you allied? You don't have any allies either, so it would just be conquering you. Fine. We'll do it anyway, and then hope for another political influence event. I'd be more than happy to sacrifice some stability or something for it. Levy Grease. Yeah, I would love to get rid of the Levy game, but unfortunately I cannot. Just win these wars for the love of bananas. You are so terrible at everything. Right, uh, we can get leather now. Which is probably what we want to get. Yes, so we have him. Oh, a breakthrough. Blended. Now, I believe we are still going to go down the route of going for wonder cre uh, creation. So we do want expanding culture. Tempted to pick up petition of mine. Oh, we should have gone for extra research. Well, we are going to get a few different things coming online soon anyway, so that should be fine. And then we'll get the um, additional research points going. Now, I guess we'll just speed up. Okay, there we go. Um, so, yeah. Let's just go for maximum research efficiency straight away. Oh my god, our research efficiency is actually terrible at the moment. That's because our army is raised, though. I just realized. So, it's not actually as bad as it would seem. Right, Tegea needs a building. Um, sure, I'll give you a farm. What are the other ones? Oh, we have literally no money. I see. <laughs> I knew that. Uh, did we get any slaves? Yes, yes we did. Okay.
get these things going. Sorted. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They sue for peace. Okay, good job. Are you not winning? Oh my god, you're getting wrecked by Galatea. How is this even possible? I'm not going to come over here and help you. Oh, they have a 18k army there. I'm sort of impressed. There we go. Right. Um, let's just have a quick look here. So if we were to build a great wonder, we would be wanting expanding culture. Government traditions. We need provincial census. And possibly just go with honored leader. Or we can... The last one isn't, but yeah, we do want... Um, common traditions. The provincial census. Which is where? I can never remember these things. That's a civic one as well, isn't it? It's... Feels like it should be somewhere here, but... Is it not? Is it somewhere here? That's the Grand Theatre. There it is. Uh, we have honored leader there as well. And I think I just want to cheekily pick up. I mean, FUG is fine. Petitioner minorities. Yeah, found city cost modifier as well. Which will save us a bit of political influence. Seems like a sensible enough choice. And apart from that, um, how much to build a building here? Well, apart from a tribal settlement, which we're just not building. That's not happening. Well, in the meantime, our ally is getting pretty wrecked. Although there are a lot of armies, so if they can just coordinate them all, it will be fine. Uh, Pelin is about to be liberated, which is great. Well, it's great for us, perhaps not as great for them. How much are these buildings? Oh, it won't tell me unless I actually have enough money. Good stuff. Or is it because... Oh, okay. 135. Uh, yeah. Well, let's just go and invade Pelin here then to make ourselves feel better and uh, flog them. Let's get Glycera there. Who are you? Just some random angry person. Who's loyalty? Right. Declare war. Take this one. Crush their army. Oh, not even bother crushing their army. Just siege them down. Okay, Thrace did win. Apparently. Which is fine. I'll take it. Or at least they didn't lose any land to them. So are we still allied? We're still allied to Thrace. Good job, Thrace. I always believed in you. Religious advances. Very nice. So... Should we just start working towards it? I think we will. So go with... Hmm this way because we kind of want yeah monthly tyranny not super keen on that one but oh well Polit politically extra political influence there at least come on chop chop seeking a patron
Hmm. All right. Scorned families, eh? The Agid family. Well, how about I give you a shiny ship? There you go. Come on, you can do this. I believe in you. Shipwrecked, lose 20 ducats. Uh, 40 ducats and gain more trade routes. I think that's what we want to do. And trade something. Dates. Fine. Get some dates going. And you're energetic. Good job. There we go. We will take all of your stuff. Imprison leaders and disband this army. Very nice. So with that, we should have some more slaves. Okay. Great stuff. It is 65, so we should be able to summon the War Council. Prepare for war with Argos. So Argos is this one, who is currently allied to Macedon, but Macedon is quite weak. It will be a bit of a pain to fight them, though. Aetolia. Aetolia is allied to Epirus. Boethia and the Antigonids. The Antigonids are pathetic at the moment, so that's actually not a terrible thing. Or Tara. The heck is Tara? That's over here. You're allied to Berithinia, so we could take over quite a chunky part of the island there. Which is also a decent enough option. Yeah. I approve of this idea. So we now have a claim on you. You're a feudatory of these guys. And that's the only relation. So... Is this all part of the same region? Yeah, it's all part of the same region, so we can also just raise the troops there. Sounds easy enough. Alright, we can raise our troops in December. So, sure, you can have military access. That seems fine. How are we doing in terms of different disgusting cultures, by the way? Still have a few Hebrews, and but apart from that, it's all looking good. The second insult. You're arrogant now as well. Sure. Whatever you say. Oh my god. Okay. Don't care. Could you just kill them, Thrace? That would be the best option. Oh, we can call down an omen again. Oh, well, let's go with discipline. And... Yeah, town criers. We do have enough political influence now to build it. We just don't have enough money. 150. That's like, actually not that much. The final insult. Okay. Nice. Stabbed in the face. All good. Fate. I will definitely pay 18 ducats for that. Although 18 ducats at the moment is quite a lot, to be fair. Right. Um, declare. Well, let's just double check. Yes, we can raise our army, so. I will declare war on you. Oh, 
Oh, he's got to kick a fort over there. I'm just going to assault this down. In fact, let's just do this as well. Get your ass over there. Just crush that army and live long and prosper. Um, let's bring our navy over there then. To make sure, because at the moment we should be getting a penalty. Yeah, it's not blockaded, so. Get our mighty navy over there. Do we want to just promote this to a city straight away? It does have a building here, which is... Oh, it's the Great Wonder. Alright, let's found the city. Okay, I currently can't siege anything. And we did get a breach, very nice. It's not fully... Sorted here, so, but I think. All good. Thrace, could you just kill these guys? That would be the sensible approach. Rather than faff about. Alright. So, finish this here and then live long and prosper. So the only problem now is that we won't be able to get rid of these troops. But I think we can cope with that. More shiny slaves. How are we doing in terms of uh, tyranny? Ah, just a mere 70. It's all fine. Everyone loves us. Good, 285 ducats. Um, I guess we can build one more here then. So we need Mantinea. So you need... Well, uh, I guess you're going to need a slave estate then. Enjoy. Did we need political influence for anything else? Yes, needs to, we need a city. Um, a megalopolis is already a city, so that's fine. Yeah. We're building Argos. It just needs population now. Which I mean we could do. It's a hundred ducats though, let's not do that right now. <laughs> we need a great temple in Olympia as well. We need so much money. Great. Um, let's spend all levies. Good stuff. So you are allied to Rhodes. Show a bunch of people over here. I mean, that's okay, but it's not super great. What do we have here? 
You don't have claims. Do I have claims here? Oh, it's occupied. Occupied. What is yellow? Oh, we're trading with them. Speaking of which, do I have any other ones? No, same ones. All right, all right. Should really look into being able to build grand theaters as well. So, did we need political influence for anything else? We do need... No. Don't think so. So we could fabricate on, say... Argos is allied to Macedon. Just a bit of a tricky one. Who are, who are you allied to? Oh, you're a revolt. Okay, let's just ignore you for now then. Um, How about... Antigonids. Antigonids are allied to those two. Do you own anything else? Or is this literally your entire existence? We have two territories apparently. Our dad is you as well. Which is part of... It's all the same region anyway. But yeah, we could fabricate on you. And see if there's anything left of these two. I don't think so. I think Korkira has this under control now. But we'll see. They might do something stupid. So, you know what? Fine. I will fabricate on you. This is a separate territory though. So we would need to siege it down. Which is a bit annoying. But hey ho. What you gonna do? Okay. We do not really care. There's a distinct lack of claims here, and a lot of spending money for stuff that I do not approve of. Um, also, we seem to have a spare fort here, which I definitely do not approve of. Spend money, you say? I or spend political influence. I'm going to spend the money. I need a political influence to fabricate a claim on this one, for instance. Macedon wants an alliance. Are you at war with anyone? Not at the moment. No. Let's not do that. We're going to fight them very, very soon, so... Feels like a foolish thing to go for that right now. Who are you underneath? You're subject to... Yeah, we could grab quite a lot of land if we were to fight the Antigonids here. Because all of your subjects. Which is pretty tasty. Alright, where else? Heraya needs a building. What do you produce? Nothing of value. Slave estate for you then. We can speed things up a bit. The co-ruler is dead. Okay. So... What happens? We have to get a new one. Alright. I have no idea where you came from or what you're doing, but... Research a dead. We get someone with the thing. We have an 8 one here, which is obsessive. That sounds great. So we can get some stuff going there. And then... Slaves become freemen, or we can gain a bunch of money. Ah. 
gain corruption and lose popularity for some money. All right, that's fine then, I guess. Need more slaves to sell. Oh, that's a new flag. I'm pretty sure that's new. Good on you. How's Rome doing, by the way? Crushing everyone around them, I presume. That was usually how it goes. Okay, that was very short-lived. Uh, we almost finished the temple. Or oh, not the temple, making you into a city. What else did we need for that one? Just needs... It needs a great temple there as well. Ruler is born, okay. And then we oh, okay, we need 25 political influence there, but that's not too bad. 25 is relatively easy. Okay, so if we are to declare war on the Antigonids. Wow, that's a lot of garbage that you're actually pulling in here. You still have a lot of feudatories. Hmm. Raise would not come in. Currently fighting a revolt. Are all of these ones loyal to you? Loyalty zero. None of them are loyal, so I'm not sure if any of them would actually come into the war. Well, to see, you're being sieged down at the moment, though. So let's see what happens afterwards. If someone takes over this, we'll have a CB on, on them anyway, so... It's all good. Okay, we now have a claim on you. Which would bring in... Roads... These one and these ones. Wouldn't too be too bad, to be honest. The only question is how they're doing in terms of ships. Quite pathetic. I might actually just be a better, straight up better option. Yeah. So you should probably just go in there. So you will have some forts somewhere. There's a fort there. Is that the only place where there is forts? Oh, you have fort there as well. I'm looking at this and I'm liking it. Because I don't know what's happening with that war. So sure, let's just wait until next month. And then we'll go for a war here and... Yeah, just grab all of their stuff. So, quick little cheeky war. Do we want to call in our ally? I mean, we could. There are, yeah, two forts here, so. Uh, there is a port there as well, so we'll put you over there. We're already paying too much for army maintenance, so this will be fine. 7k? Really? How do you have that many troops? Veterans move on, alright. Well, we'll just have to smash them to bits then. That is not what I expected. You're already starving to death. Oh, you got no food. How do you have 7k? It is... Impressive in some ways. Hopefully you just go and smash my... Um, 
allies army here that is a lot of troops I'm, I'm jealous now <laughs> what's your population no 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 you stay there 90 Oh, they're starving again. Did they not have any food when they got raised? Or did some weird merging happen? Um, I don't like this. I think we're just going to assault this down. Yes, yes. And bring you over here. I he might charge into these guys, but that's okay. Okay. Something freaky was happening there, but we do have enough to... Oh, we lost all of our import routes here. Nice, nice, nice. Well, we can get precious metals back. Oh, it's a revolt happening up there. I see. Let's get some leather and... I don't know what else. Stone. There we go. Sorted. This does not allow them to pick up more food quicker. Is it going to come and actually charge into them here? Because I have a feeling this guy is not going to give me the... Um... Ooh, get a bunch of free men and extra morale of armies. That sounds great. Let's go with that. I mean, if you're just going to straight up lose here, then by all means, go for it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, he's going to run away, which is understandable. He's going to try and siege that back. Let's see if I can recover a bit more. I do have a donkey. Something must have gone very weird here. But that's okay. Uh, how much do we need? 235 will reach the armies this month, so... Riots in the capital? Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I've never seen that one before. Alright. Let's just wait until next month. Go smash this army and then go and siege down the stuff. There we go. 40 food. Should be enough. Okay, he's running away. Which is uh, to be expected. Right. Crush these troops. And no one's pissed off at the moment. Um, I think we'll put this guy who's relatively loyal. and we'll see whether we can get some more political influence going. Now with this, I'm not sure whether we want to bother going and actually trying to grab the other guys. I mean, getting roads at least would be nice, but if we can stay off the mainland, that's fine. Food shortage. Can we beat them in a siege race? We should be able to, but you never know. And I would like some more stone, please. Thank you. Build cost is down. What happened here, though? You're still just siege down and nothing exciting happening. Do I have a claim on you? Still allied to the Antigonids. Would they come in? They would come in. We'll just get a claim going here as well. Sure. I don't think Kokira is that bad. We can probably just beat them. I was actually sieging down my ally anyway, so we really do not care. Okay. Alright, let's just crush his navy. Very nice. And rather than fight his army, I think we'll just take all of his stuff. 
We'll just keep this war quick and easy. And yeah. Get some shiny slaves. We're not at war, so we can wait for you to be fully recovered and then we can disband you. So yeah, for now, then let's just get rid of these guys. We need money to build these stupid buildings after all, so... Actually, come to think of it, um, how are we doing with laws? Can we change to conversion laws at the moment? No, we need prescribed cannon. Which is where? Down there. Might be worth just going down and sort that one out straight away. Just so we can change into those ones. Uh, that seems to be the sensible thing to do. Um, how are we doing with forts here now? Too many. Okay, there we go. We do also have a new shiny wonder, which is not amazing, but it'll do. So you can just stay somewhere. Um, I think that's fine. We can probably just disband the levies. Let them chill for a bit. And then, yeah, the question is whether to go to war with the Antigonids or not. This is now being sieged down by... Who? Hypolia. Where's you? Twisting the knife. Alright. Macedon is being wrecked by who? Miletos. I don't know what Macedon is doing, but they're not doing it very well, that's for sure. Yeah, I think we just need to... You're allied only to some Mesapian over there. I think we can definitely take you. I think... We want to start fabricating on you as well. And just go from there. Cute are needed. Okay. Um, tutor. Give you a... Sure. Martial education. Also, I think we are going to dissolve this alliance. We are going to want to eat them up relatively soon. We'd want a great temple here, but we also want one here, right? Yeah, let's get that great temple going. We need two more buildings here. One in Clator and one in Stimpala. So Clator here, do you have anything good? Yes, you can have a farm. Okay. Get a farm going there. <clears throat> Argos here is allied to Macedon. I mean, Macedon is failing horribly at every front, but... Yes, Minister of Excellence. Sounds very good. We're definitely going to hold the games. And what else did we need here? So, more buildings. Need 25 population. Which is just... Ah, it's got 17 at the moment. So, we could always just shift some people over there. Wouldn't be the worst. Um... You just need to complete this one, and then we get some more free men, which is always good. We need 100 gold for this one at least. Argos needs 15 population, which again shouldn't be too bad. You can always just shift the slaves over. But yeah, we need to attack some more people though. Who are you? Italian Revolt. All right. Um, 
can we get the war council again? I don't think so. Especially not if I can't find the right thing to click. No, 75. Alright, well... Splendid event. Hang on. Should we go for it? <clears throat> I'm thinking we shall. Because it looks scary here, but I don't think all of these ones will come in. And Thrace might actually come in relatively soon. Besides, they're not all going to make it over here anyway, surely. You know what? Screw it. Go for it. Uh, we did lose iron though, which is less than ideal. And I think what we want to do is we'll go and crush these guy first. So let's just raise our troops here. March you over there. Grab that. I'll have you faff about here just in case there are some stupid navies coming along. And they are all technically in the war. But we'll see if they really are. Wow, that was incredibly terrible. We can call you. We cannot call you in. <laughs> Says you can call be called in, but the game is apparently lying. All right. Let's see whether we can siege this down. How much food do you have now? You do have a decent chunk of food at the moment. So at the moment, it's all fine. There are quite a few troops faffing about down here. And Epirus does have a freaking huge navy. I did not expect that. I kind of need you to hide somewhere. Like there. Alliance offer from Macedon. Okay, you know what? Macedon... Uh, Thrace does not want to come. Macedon, do you want to join me in this war? There we go. That should distract everyone. Um, that is never going to happen. Thank you for your consideration. And we shall definitely go with extra discipline. And if we can... We're already spending that money. Interesting. So now we have Macedon, who will hopefully distract them enough. They do have some troops over here at least, so they should be able to form some form of distraction. Not the end of the world if that falls. Obviously I would prefer if it didn't, but... We should still be able to piece out this guy, which is the main plan. Okay, Thrace would join now. Thank you. Alright. Now it's all... Ooh. Oh, that's Epirus now. Alright. Interesting. Still, should be fine. Come on, just give me the siege. A breach? Anyone want to give me a breach? Thank you. I will assault it down. Oh, this is brutal assault. Uh, let the looting be gentle. Then we should be able to scare you off. But that was not as nice as intended. But we should be able to just kick you out of this war. Imprison leaders. And live long and prosper. And with that we should be able to sell off some slaves here. And possibly hire some mercs. Which wouldn't be a absolutely terrible idea. Alright. Get you on top here. Uh, how's it doing? 14%. That one could potentially fall. 
Do we have 182 ducats? I think we might hire some mercs here. Six and a half K for those ones. Get you over to... I guess we'll get you over to there. Macedon is happily sieging them down. Siege of Elid is lost. Yeah, yeah, that was kind of expected. That's alright. We'll get it back though. Fuck, let's just march over there now. Turn off reorganization. Your morale is fine. Get you there. Chop, chop. Okay. Get you reorganizing for a month or so. Uh, there should, there's only a hundred there, so I think two siege ticks, and we got that one. And if he wants to try and come and rescue it, then so be it. Get you there. Um, yeah. Oh, we can get good natured. What does that do? Don't know, but we do have need for gold, so. <laughs> Supply shortage. Um, becomes friend with Kidonian person. Sure. You're going to actually come and try and attack me? Alright, and we do now have a claim on you. Very nice. And you're sieging down that. Even nicer. Which is technically their war goal, so. There we go. That's Ellis taken back. Now, do I want to fight these guys? It is Megara and Athens. We are also at war with Naxos here. I would very much like to land some troops there and grab all of Naxos. Capital is there and it's a humongous freaking fort of death. Um, but we are going to need to wait at least so this one can recover some troops. Are you going to come and fight these guys? You're more than welcome to try. Uh, we're not going to... We're definitely going to neglect the arts. Oh, you changed your mind, did you? Well... Isn't that a surprise? I will have to see. I presume that they're not going to give any of these sieges to me. Where is Megara anyway? That is Megara, okay. And Megara is a feudatory, okay. So we can't just piece them out and steal all of their stuff, unfortunately. <clears throat> I want to fight you, but I'd rather fight you with the mercs. Could send you over to take over the siege. Then get the mercs to go and fight these guys. That might be the sensible thing to do. Um, can we get gold? No, we could get spices though, so sure. Let's get spices going while we have the chance. And how are these people looking? <clears throat> this stuff here is all being dealt with by all of these faffing about subjects, but come on. Yes, Otricia. Fascinating. That's never happened before. Alright. Get you chasing. Oh my god, it's so slow. Alright, he's going to get stuck on that fort, so we're going to crush that army. And all will be well. Where are you retreating to now? Oh, 
Uh, can you just walk through all of this? I might walk with you as well. No, I'm not. Minor addendum. Um, I think we'll definitely go for that. Should we take you over to here? I kind of think we should. Let's get the navy going. Get you on the ships. And then we'll just take you over and start sieging that down. Because this area should be under control now. There we go. Let the looting be gentle. How are you doing in terms of food? You got plenty of food. Let's get you on the next one then. And we'll get you on the ship. Sail you over to here. And we'll just plant you on the port. And go from there. Okay, more advances. Um, are we going? Yeah, let's go down there. So, unintegrated, tolerated cults, and then prescribed cannon. We're not going to be building any wonder anytime just yet, so... There's 4,000 troops there. That is Andros. Hmm... That's a bit more than I had anticipated. I mean, we can go and... This is occupied by Macedon, yeah. That is to be expected. <clears throat> See whether we can sneak through here and... Let's siege this one quickly. Yeah, Andros, do you want to give me military access? You do. Alright. Are there anyone we can peace out? I think they're all subjects. Which is a bit of a shame. Um, okay. White pea is there. Now we do have 57 war scores. We could potentially just go... Well, these are... <clears throat> all giving them to someone else. We don't want that, of course. And because this is occupied by that one, we can't take that either. That's a bit annoying. Okay, we did do this occupation, which is part of this area here. We can also just shift you... Can I beat this army? Probably. Easily. Oh, but we need even more troops to actually siege it down. All right. Uh, hmm. Well, let's get you over there then for a second. 44 freaking navy there. Get you over here, get you ready. In fact, we can send some troops over here to just get this one siege while we're at it. Okay, there's 2k on it. Let's maybe wait then. Ah, so awkward. Okay, we lost precious metals. Apparently they're blockading now, but that won't be very long. How many do we need? I presume it's 6k then. Um, none. 2,000 per level, yes. We need six. Which you do not have. Alright. And we're missing iron. This, oh, this is level two as well. Okay, this is actually his capital. And there's no fort here, so... At least that's 
going our way. We just need to get this sorted and then get these troops over. Oh, this is the Antigonid Revolt now. Which I am technically at war with. There's only... Oh, they're, all, they're actually sieging my stuff as well. Could you finish? Thank you. Let the looting be gentle. Alright, we're going to need to deal with this then. So, get you... Pause. Get you over here. Get you smashing this army. Oh my god, could you please stop it? I just want to have some imports in peace. Chase down this army. Should be relatively easy to crush if we roll something that's not a 1, although it was still easy to crush. Get you over there. Um... Okay, who is this? Oh, the Macedonian Revolt as well. Oh my god. And we lost Iron again. Could you not stop sieging it? They are sieging it back and forth between each other. Um, but yeah, we would need a few more troops here. Or these guys. I mean, we could just take like a thousand of these ones. Let's get... Yeah... Get you two, get you down here, get you there, and then we'll have enough troops to actually siege this down. Sparta loses of Delphi, the holy site where? One of ours? Who owns Delphi? Oh no, it's here. Um, we, we don't care. If it's not our temple, then we're not super interested to say, to be perfectly honest. Alright, we can get you over there, we can get all of Naxos, which is the primary prize, I'd say. Do you only have the one province? Please let me click on you. Okay, um... Yes. Ah, Bountiful Harvest. I think we'll take the money, we got plenty of stability. So that's not really a concern. Get you on the ships. Get you over here. We'll conduct a full and fair investigation. And we'll shove... Um, you there. Which is probably the person we just kicked out. Okay. File developments, leave no stone unturned. Get these troops there. And get you hiding somewhere. Get you over there. It's a thousand troops there now, not for long. Thank you. Okay, now we'll be able to siege that one down. This siege is... Progressing as intended. All is well. We could hand off some stuff to whatever, but let's not bother with that. Civic advances means we are tolerated cults, so soon we'll be able to have that. Occupied by the Macedonian Revolt. We don't really care. If you don't give the occupations to us, then it's sort of... Now, this is all occupied by Thrace because they actually want the land. Yeah, I mean, nothing's going to be given to you, Thrace, or any of the other ones. So, you can just keep on dreaming. Mm. Alright, where we're at. We need some random researcher to die. Uh, perfect. There we go. 11 skill and a scholar. That's what we like to see. 
So we're going to take all of this land and obviously... Is it occupied by me still? Yes, yes. We do need to siege down this stupid little island as well though, but that's okay. If we can get this one, no. Minus 28%. I mean, ideally we'd want to blockade this one, but well, actually his navy is gone. Uh, where's my navy then? Where did your navy go? Pretty sure you had a sizable one standing in here. Well, if you're not there, then... Unrivaled wealth. This two-year-old is getting a thousand ducats. Alright, you can have the thousand ducats, child. I would prefer to have it, but fine. Seven percent? No. There are no other forts, at least. Um, we just need the capital here, which does have troops on it, but no fort, if I remember correctly. Okay, and we can go for prescribed cannon, which means we can now change the law. I don't think we need that, but let's get some pop assimilation speed. And speaking of which, when it comes to our capital... Because um, we have the look at the population here. <clears throat> Pretty much everyone is the correct, well, everyone's the correct religion, but not everyone is the correct culture, so I think we'll go with cultural assimilation here. Ah, let the looting be gentle. Let you bugger off. I will imprison your leaders. Great. I will take this army over to there. We'll take this over to here and then oh hello babes how is uh, I miss you too and love you how is um, I can't remember the name of the city Copernicus birthplace and we're losing iron again because why not Right, so but that should be it. We finished this siege, we finish everything here, and I should probably be quicker to go this way. Look, I just want you to get on top of there, whatever's the quickest way. Just go for it. The sacking of Delos, let the looting be gentle. Excellent, and uh, there shouldn't be any other forts now, so we just need to get on top of them here, and then, yeah, live long and prosper. And we're definitely going to hold the Olympics. Crush that army. How many people live here? Well, people. What in the heck? Do something about this guy. You can be ambitious. And let the looting be gentle. Alright. So, what we want here is... We want... Nesiotic stuff. We want... Megaran stuff. Antigonid stuff. And not give anything else to anyone else. Sounds good. 79. Everyone loves this. And imprison leaders, imprison leaders, imprison leaders. Ah. Oh. Glorious. And let's just disband the levies. And let's have a look at the... Yeah, we do have a bunch of boards, which we do not want. That all looks fine now. We're not going to have a Giga Fort over here. That's not happening. Okay, this all seems fine. Um, there was something else. 
Oh yes, slaves. All the slaves in the world. Oh god. This is so painful. Of all of those ones. So, are you in the hotel now, or are you still rummaging through the town? Get rid of you. 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 So much slavery. 82 tyranny. Might be a tad bit high, but I think it's all going to go fine. What's the main threshold for civil war? Yeah, I mean, that's the painful one, but we're not really large enough for a civil war to be any real concern just yet. Uh, who are you? Okay. Right, we're up to 600 ducats. Um, yes, we do have some mercenaries which we do not want to keep. Let's get rid of them. So now economy should be fine. Uh, rural, we still need something to be built in Stimphalos. Wherever the heck you are. Uh, that would be you. So you can have a slave estate. Uh, we need more people there, which is fine. You just shift some slaves over. Move some, preferably, yeah, non, like, Arcadians. Aetolians, Arcadians, there we go. So now, get that one. We're honored, and then we can spend 25 political influence to get them as a feudatory, which gives the state religion happiness. Sounds great. Means we do not have this one, which is a bit of a shame. But I think that's okay. And what else? Because what? Well, I can't see what we got there now. Um, it will be... Yeah, state religion happiness, it's probably better. I mean, it's a mission, we want to complete the mission anyway. Right, next mission. So we're waiting for this one to complete. Then we might need to shift some population over to Argos. As a population, well, it will be Megalopolis for sure. Northern coastline. We just need to wait for that one to finish. Okay. Now, we do have a claim on you. Three hundred and thirty-one against us, 482. Could just go and charge straight into them. Which wouldn't be absolutely terrible. Should I pause though at least. So Athens here is now. You have an alliance with some people. But you are essentially free. Which means we probably want to fabricate a little claim on you. And get Athens going as well. You can have military access if you want. No problem. Okay. 
That was very quick. Yeah, you can have military access as well. Making eight ducats per month now, which is not too shabby. Um, rebuilding Argos. So we can just shift people off over there as well to Argos. Uh, move pops from shore. Need one more. Not from Megalopolis. Let's move one from Claytor. And then get that one sorted. Very nice. Rural here. We still need to wait for that one to finish. But then we can also just shift some freaking people over to there. Raise the price of grain. Or gain some... Oh, fine. We'll raise the price of grain. It's fine. Fortifying. Three fortress buildings there. It is Corinthos. Wow, I mean... How much is a fort? It'll take like seven years. Ugh. I don't want to do that. That's We're skipping that part of the mission. I, I, it's too much. Although... I don't know. Fine, fine, I'm going to do it. I am going to hate it, but we're building three freaking forts there. Ugh, disgusting. Splendid event. Um, oh, they love, uh, I love them apparently. Just foolish, all right. Apparently that's what we do now. Who owns this? Uh, it's not part of this chain anyway. I mean, I'm curious to see whether we're going to get any missions for this stuff up here. So I'm kind of tempted not to go to war up there just yet. Oh, got the thing. More stability? Sure. We're technically losing stability at the moment. Although, not entirely sure. Oh, okay. Odrissi has declared war again. Um, maybe we should cancel this alliance <laughs> with Thrace. They don't seem to be doing anything useful these days. Hey Rome, how do you feel about being allies? Another oh my god, chill, chill, chill. Okay. That was nothing of interest anyway. Athens, who is allied to Argos. And Aeolia. Aeolia is over there, so we don't care about those ones. You have a shiny great wonder as well. Monthly political influence plus 10 or point 10. That is actually quite handy. I wouldn't mind grabbing that one. Bond of childhood. Interesting indeed. To speed things up a bit. Obviously, Epirus needs to be punished as well, but. 400 days for that one. And then we can shift all the troops to there. Up to 13 troops now. Oh, we do have some... No, they're already being slavified. Arcadians. We have 138 Cretans. It would be possible to integrate them, but I'm not so keen. I have a lot of Aegeans as well. We'll see. We'll get some conversions happening here, hopefully. Okay, nice. So, prescribed cannon. Um, we were also then looking towards provincial census. Now, this is the quickest way to go here. So, this is diplomatic reputation, diplomatic range. None of them are super great, so we'll just push down here, I think. 
and then go from there. And then I think we can actually look at building our first wonder. Who are you? Olympia. Okay. Why are you here? Oh well. I'm sure you're doing something very sensible. What's the silly kids doing? They don't seem very strong. Rome is roaming, as per usual. So nothing really new there. Tutor needed. You're in poor health, re uh, inflammation, dysentery. Well, I mean, good luck. Here you go, have a martial education. Uh, my navy should bring you in there. And also we should actually stop spending on our army. 100 ducats, you say, or 3 stability, or crucify them. Tyranny is a bit high. Let's just take the money. We have a claim on Athens, and I think we'll just go with some shiny discipline for now. So, Athens is currently at war with who? Macedonian Revolt has 13k. I thought I was Macedonian Revolt. Which is fine. So I can declare war on you. You will bring in Argos, which we want. Thebes, which we also want. Boethia, which we want. And Aeolia, which is somewhere over there, which we can just ignore. Oh, we have a truce with you. Okay, well, let's ignore that for now, then. Odrysia sues for peace. Very nice. It's never happened before. Uh, did we have a claim on you? I have military access. Uh, so, let's start by cancelling military access. Who? Oh, that's me. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm going to become brain damaged. I know it. Treatment successful. Never mind. We are imperfect. Let's go back to influencing then. So. What was I thinking? Ah, oh, missions. Okay, slave estate is done in a few more days. There we go. So, step in the right direction. We can also do this one. Gives us some more freemen. Very nice. We can do this one. Excellent. And civilizing the valley, which just means... Needs a civilization value of 50, though. What have you got at the moment? 45... It's growing very, very slowly. We could change this, though, to civilization effort. That's barely making any change. 0.11 each month. I mean, it is quicker. Uh, we can also plonk down a great temple. Sure. We're all pretty much spent all of our money. But I would kind of like this. This is a decent enough buff. Local tax. Pop assimilation speed is the good one. I mean, these ones are nice as well. So, we still have some time anyway. It's not the end of the world. And then we'll have to see whether they have another mission tree or not. I'm not sure. I didn't actually read up on it. There might be another one. There might not. Military down to 12 troops, which is not great. I mean, integrating troops would be better, but, you know. Oh, yeah. War without CB. Okay, so we don't have a CB against you. Let's get that going then. Okay. 
Because why not? And a truce with you is up when? Probably easy to check like this. 81, it's four years left. Oh god. That is a bit painful. Sure, he'll be welcome in Sparta. In case we need him for anything. Okay. Yeah, Rome is starting to look um, relatively scary over there. We need, I mean, should we just declare war on them? Kind of want to wait for the mission to finish to see if we get any missions for it, though. Civilization value is the main problem here. So it's for, it's not... Um, just wait a little longer. Do you want the job, eh? Oh my god, you... This is the primary air? Depressed, infection, miserly, proud, cautious, blood of the whatever, firstborn. Wow, you are... Shit. <laughs> Still, I could do it with the money, so... Um, uh, would you like to be the... Commander of this navy? With your zero martial skills. Sort by martial. And scroll down to the very bottom. But you do not even show, because they're that terrible. Well, um, you did have six in, well, actually, we do have someone who's terrible here, so you know what? There you go. You're technically slightly better. Now, give me some money, please. Hopefully quite a lot. Probably not that much at this stage of the game, but I'd want some money, please. Do we have a truce with you? I don't actually have a truce with you, so we could fabricate on you instead. we we'll just bring Athens, though. Rather than if we're declaring war on Athens, they'll bring in... ...a lot more troops, which is what we want. Still... Let's just fabricate on you as well. While we're at it. 82 ducats. I mean, it's better. Thrace, for the love of bananas, could you deal with them? Just get rid of them. This is getting ridiculous. I have no interest in being part of your war. Right, how are we doing here then? So, still need two more forts to be built. Breakthrough, very nice. I will take that. And... We'll go for foreign network then, which is obviously terrible, but it allows us to get provincial census afterwards. Um, Trophius or just a random 29 year old? Let's send off the random 29 year old. Okay, we do have a claim on you now. So I guess... Well, you have forts in both provinces as well because you are extra annoying. Still, let's just go for it. Give us something to do at least. We'll get you up here. Um, we can probably split you in half. And just go like that. In the off chance of finding the elusive animal, there is a possibility a ruler may die. I mean, I don't want my... Can I... Hmm... This guy is actually pretty decent, however the primary heir, wherever they are, is garbage and I can't do anything here now. There is a possibility, ah oh, screw it. Okay. So how do we change who our heir is? I would like to anoint basically anyone else. Like, this three-year-old has pretty much better stats than you do. Yeah, he's the only one. There we go. This is for the best. 
I'm putting my faith in... Oh my god, you're incapable. I mean, you are three years old, so... It's only finesse. Alright. Very well. Well, the good news is we didn't die. Um, Alright. Should probably bring our navy over to go and blockade these ones as well. And take it from there. Call you in? Nah. They're not going to do anything anyway because they're busy with these stupid Adrissians here which they can't seem to sort out. So we'll take this and once that's done, claim on Argos should be done and we can at least take Athens and go from there. And how are we doing with the old mission here then? Yeah, so we still need a bit more time for the forge. How is... 48.87. Okay, so this shouldn't be a problem. Then we can just shift some slaves over and we'll finish that part of the mission tree as well and see if there's another mission tree after this one. And after that we'll look at, you know, conquering all of Anatolia, etc, etc. It should go a lot quicker once we stop being, or once I stop being bound to the mission. Uh, let the looting be gentle. Kill the navy. Finish this one. Where are you actually going now? You don't own any other troops anywhere, do you? No, we don't want to call you in. Come on, chop chop. Can't siege it either, so... Uh, do I? Is that? Oh yeah, it is my giant fort. I keep forgetting. Alright. Thank you. Give me all of that. And imprison your leaders. Very good. And then we can disband the... Oh no, because I'm at war. Right, let's get you out there then. And... Um... Capital is over there. Right, get rid of these two forts then. <clears throat> Come on. So what we'll do then is get you over here, get ready to us, because you don't... You don't even have a fort there, so that will be very, very quick to siege down. And this is going to finish very soon. Get you going, you can just stay there. Tender support. White piece, yes. Gain tyranny or just get some money. Right. <clears throat> so we're going to get the claim on Argos, the claim on Argos, steal Athens, finish the mission tree, and all going to be splendid. <clears throat> all right. Probably speed up. Oops, that was a bit too quick. Right, invention. Provincial sensor. So now we can start saving up to building a wonder, which is going to be a bit... Did I get slaves that I haven't sold yet? Yes, I did. All right. Let's sell them off then before... Okay, great. And declare war on you. Second of April, that'll do. Get you over to Athens. And slow down before I do something horrible. 500 troops. We can probably just assault this down, to be honest. Okay. And I don't think they own anything else, so 
We should be safe. Athens? No, Athens. Oh, this stuff is Athens as well. Um, do they have a fort up here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Do I want this, though? I mean, I want it eventually, but I think we can go without this for now. We'll just finish this war quickly by um, just sieging down this one. Then it's all good. Oh, good. My subject is actually going to go and beat him up. Uh, let the looting be gentle, and I just want these things. Unaffected by our rule, and imprison leaders. Great. And we can then disband this one. So, Athens um, is the capital. We don't need forts here, right? No. We should be good. There are no other forts hiding anywhere. Nope. All looking fine. Um, decision. 20 political influence for 2 extra base production. Sounds great. I'm not sure why the AI didn't do that. Or maybe it is per country level. But it is a provincial modifier though. I don't know. Weird. <clears throat> you are disloyal. Why? Power base of supporters, friend of rival of ruler, ambitious. So, friend of rival of ruler. I have a rival. Yes. Oh, my co -Basilius. Um. That seems like a terrible, terrible choice. But who am I to question the wisdom of our glorious leader? Should probably get rid of that as soon as we have enough political influence. That should actually get rid of the disloyal character as well. Alright. Um, remove rival, please. Go. Yes. Now everyone is giga happy. We do have 700 shiny ducats. Fortress is about to be built, which will grant us... Extra building slots, local population happiness, yada yada yada. Tutor needed for yet another child. Uh, good to know. You get... How terrible are you? Give you a um, charisma. And how are we doing here? Yes, 51. And we even got 21 people here. Um, which is great. Incoming migration, that's a bit too long. So what we'll do then is we're just going to move some... Not from Sparta. Get some people from Argos, sure. There we go. Civilizing the valley, sorted. And... Someone has been murdered, we're powerless to act. And instead, we will put... Sure, you can be in charge there. Come on, chop chop. Finish this one as well. And finish this. Which gives us a, bus, a bunch of bonuses. Okay, we have finally achieved our goal of becoming the hegemon of all the pol all of this place. After a defeating, after a defeating each, after defeating each of our ancient rivals, with our local adversaries crushed and subjugated, we must start looking past our borders at the dangers that may surface. There are those who are jealous of our quick rise to power, and the wealth of the this area is sure to attract attention as well. Get a bunch of bonuses. Uh, suffered many rivals. To the Macedonians, the Thebans, the Athenians. Okay. Conquered our ancient rivals. Betrayal of subjects. Blah, 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 blah. And rebuilt the foundation of the ancient Polyponnesian League. Alright. Well, I am... 
I am going to take a break here. I might be back later on today for some more streaming. Otherwise, I'll probably be streaming tomorrow. But I need to get some stretching going and probably eat, so... Yeah, I might stream more later on tonight. Otherwise, we shall see. So, for now, thank you very much. And I will see you next time, hopefully. can find out to turn off the stream. <laughs>